to neutral side action, and we're just about ready for kickoff. And now let's head down to the coin toss. It's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. We'll see how these two teams play in this game as they prepare for the opening kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out. On the field for the first drive. After positive yardage, they get about four on that keeper. Makes it second and six. From their own 29 yard line, it's second down. Nice run there. This is so difficult to defend. Well, this is a perfect illustration of how to run the option, and it was perfect enough to get the first right there. And he makes it out to about the 37-yard line. That brings up second and nine. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 37. They'll bring him down at the 50. So he keeps it, and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. And they got him for a loss. Loss of one for the fullback. The defender snuck right through the blocks and just drilled the ball carrier. That's a standout play. It's second down, 12 to go. Ball on their own 49. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. And he's finally taken down at the 21-yard line. So with that run, they pick up another first. It's a nice job again up front by the offensive line. They're doing a good job of neutralizing the defensive front, and it's allowed them to move the ball down the field. Side brought down. This is the eighth play of this drive. Tackle at the 19 yard line. Let's move the game at two yards. Third down. From the 19 yard line. Third down. He's going to try and scramble. And they make the stop, the nine-yard line. I give a lot of credit to the offensive coordinator there. Great play call. Here's play number 10 on the drive. He's taken down around the 12-yard line. Brings up a second and goal. Ball on the 12. That's a great tackle at the 17. Horrible loss of five yards on the play. That makes it third and goal. Here's the 12th play of the drive. Now we'll see how the backup can do after that injury. 
Zips it to the tailback incomplete. He comes up short. I know sometimes backs don't have the greatest hands, but the quarterback is being too careful here. You just got to hit him with it. Fourth down. So the field goal unit is on the field. They'll try for three points. He gets it up, and they tack on three points. Georgia Tech gets set to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He gets out to about the 22-yard line. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. Brought down around the 24-yard line. Gain of two yards. That makes it second and eight. Second and eight. Ball on their own 24. Tries to fit it in there, but it's picked off. Number 12 with the interception. It's a great job in coverage by this linebacker. He does a good job of reading the quarterback's eyes and is able to come up with the interception. Georgia Tech has a three-point lead. They go with a run, and he brought down in the backfield. Loss of two yards on the play. That'll bring up second and 12. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball in the 29. They go to the left for a nice game. Game of four on the play. That'll make it third and nine. a bad play overall by the offense. The quarterback's doing everything he can to be able to make the play work and try to execute. The problem is the offensive line did not do a good job protecting him. They're very fortunate that ball wasn't intercepted. Kicks away, and it's good! And he's got to be happy about that kick. Oh, no question. This kid is just a solid kicker. 6 nothing. Georgia Tech. King has the ball set, and he looks ready to kick this one deep. Jennings takes it at the four, across the 30. Tackle made at the 34. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. And he's tackled at the 36. From their own 36-yard line. Second down. Tackle made at around the 48-yard line. That's good for a game of 12 yards. First down. Somebody jumped early down there. Ball start, offense. That penalty will move them back a bit. Yeah, and with so many young guys out Still there, it's down. bound to happen occasionally. First and 15 now after the penalty. Oh, got he's in trouble, and he's hit before he can go anywhere. Second and in inches. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. Throws to the receiver, incomplete. Not a great throw by the quarterback, but to be fair, that was pretty good coverage. And down he 
goes at the 35 yard line. Curve makes the tackle at the 35 yard line. First down. From the 35 yard line, it's first down. Quick throw. Not a real fancy play here, just a smartly run route. Good protection and a well-placed ball. Most times, you don't need much more than that. From the 19-yard line, first down. Complete. He's got room. What a play, and that is first and goal. Gain of 12 yards. That makes it first and goal. And this is the eighth play of the drive. On the ground with the tailback. Runs outside for a nice game. Chandler gets six yards on the carry. That brings up second and goal. From the one-yard line. Second down. Touchdown, Tennessee! There are some guys, when they get near the goal line, they just have a knack for getting the ball into the end zone. That's what we saw right there. They'll try to tack on the extra point that will take the lead. And he converts the extra point. A nice nine play, 71 yard drive. And they come away with a touchdown. Zimaglia looks ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Every single time this offense has the ball, they're moving the football, but they're settling for field goals. And every time they settle for field goals, I've been watching the defense that they've been facing and watching how they run off the field to celebrate a job well done because they're not giving up touchdowns. That's a bad sign. He's tackled at the 22-yard line. Second and 13 coming up here. Ball on their own 22. They'll knock him down for a loss. After the sack, it's now fourth and long. Jennings is back deep to return the punt. Taken down at the 49. They moved the ball very effectively on their last drive, which ended with a touchdown. The defense has been talking it over on the sideline, trying to make some corrections. Let's see if they can stop them this time. And it was a really nice drive, too, Brad. The quarterback got into a nice rhythm and did a good job of picking apart the defense. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Tennessee up a point. He's at the 20. There's a strike complete. And he's taken down at the 16-yard line. Man, that was an impressive looking play. When you can slice apart a defense like that, it puts a seed of doubt in their minds. From the 16-yard line. First down. Five wide. And a quick throw. They'll bring him down around the six yard line. That's a gain of 10 on the play. That'll make it second and in inches.
It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. Got a man open, touchdown. He fired it out to his wide receiver, who made the grab and got the score. When this guy's got time to throw, he makes the defense pick. Point. A four play, 49 yard drive, and they put up seven points. So our score 14 6. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Nice run there. The fullback showing some good skills there on the option. He got five. That brings up second and from their own 30-yard line. Second down. He makes it out to maybe the 33-yard line. Benson picks up around three on the option to the fullback. receiver and he dropped it boy that hurts the offense to have to go three and out they're gonna have to think about how to get something going the next time they come out that'll make it fourth and two Jennings is the deep man awaiting the return booming kick fielded at the 19 and he's tackled at the 29 yard line Tennessee's lighting up the scoreboard so far and the guys on the other sideline are having to settle for field goals and that's got to change if they're going to have a chance to be able to win this game they're moving the ball well but they've got to put the ball into the end zone they did a great job on their last drive moving the ball down the field for a touchdown let's see if they can duplicate that on this drive <laughs> this offensive coordinator's got to be feeling so good about the execution that he's seeing from his quarterback and his wide receiver. Because, again, they put so much time into trying to put a plan together. And to be able to see that actually come into play makes you feel pretty good as a play caller. From their own 46-yard line, it's first down. Tennessee up by eight. Pass complete and taken down immediately. Johnson with the tackle up at the 49-yard line. That brings up second and five. Watch the run. Watch the run. 51, Mike. Mike 51. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Game of five on the play. That makes it first and ten. First down, ten yards to go. Ball on the 44-yard line. Nice run, and he's brought down. Gain of five yards. A long way yet to go, but at the end of one, Tennessee's up by eight. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. After a decent run up the gut. Called a gain of six yards. First down. From the 33 yard line. First down. Three down, three down. Mike 51. Mike 51. He's going to try and scramble. Dives for extra yardage. The stop at the 23. That's a gain of two on the play. First down. From the 23 yard line. First down. Tennessee is up by eight. Four, four. 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 
catches it, and that's all. A seven-yard gain that time from the play-action pass completion. It's the ninth play of the drive. Zips it to the tight end, and he hits him hard at the eight-yard line. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. He's taken down right around the six-yard line. About two yards there on that delayed handoff. That brings up second and goal. And this is the 11th play of the current drive. Slings it out of bounds at the one yard line. Gain of six yards. That makes it third and goal. From the one yard line, third down. They'll spread the field with five wide. Just throws this one away. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. He gets it up, and it's good. Maglia has his kick team lined up, and he is set to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. him down for a loss on the play. He knew it was a run all the way. Got a good jump. Once he got there, he wasn't about to let him slip away either. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Doesn't look like he's going to have much time to get rid of this punt. Oh, excellent punt. Jennings fields it at the 22, and he's hammered down. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead, and on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. They give to the tailback. Brought down around the 33-yard line. That'll make it second and seven. It's second down, seven to go. Ball on the 33. Quick pass intercepted. Inside the 30. The 10. He's all the way. Touchdown. So a great play by the defender to give his team six points. That was a very good play, and that will certainly help build his team's momentum. He makes the PAT. This one away. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. Tackle made the 26 yard line. It's going to be interesting now to see if this quarterback can put that last throw behind him. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on capitalizing off of mistakes. He's to the 40. And down he goes at around the 48-yard line. 
that makes it first and ten. Man, From their own 48-yard line, it's first down. Tennessee holds a four-point lead. You know, at that point, I think, Brad, the quarterback's just better off just taking a sack. You have to be very careful as you're feeling pressure to throw the ball just to throw the ball. If you feel like you're not going to be able to make the play and the defense got you, just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. Tackled after a decent pickup. That's good for a gain of five yards. Third down. From the 47-yard line, third down. the delay and he's brought down immediately and the halfback's got nowhere to go Fourth down. he's going to try to cough and corner this one that turned out to be a nice little punt there it was just a little pooch kick but it was very effective Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Tackle made at the 18-yard line. It's second and 11. Ball on the 18-yard line. They get nice yardage on that run. Marshall gains about five yards on the option play. That'll bring up 36. He's on the run. He's tackled right around the 24-yard line. Deep to return. He gets out to about the 42-yard line. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Tennessee is up four. Quick out to his receiver. And he's tackled at about the 49. Seven yards. That'll make it second and two. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Throws complete. He's got space to work. He's at the 40. Knocked out of bounds. Around the 36 yard line. That's good for a gain of 15 yards. First down. From the 36-yard line, first down. Good outside run there. Six yards there on the option keeper. Six yards. That'll make it second and four. He's at the 20. Tackle around the 18 yard line. First down. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 18 yard line. Throws it in a hurry. And he's taken down at the 7. That's good for a gain of 11 yards. That makes it first and goal. Quick strike, and it's caught for the touchdown. You know, this entire group functions so well as a unit, and you saw it on that touchdown. Very good team effort. And he adds 
needs the extra point. Maglia gets set to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So we're just about ready to return to action. They'll bring him down at the 37th. From their own 37-yard line. First down. Up the middle for a nice game. That's a gain of five on the play. That makes it second and six. And he makes it out to about the 44-yard line. That's good for a gain of two yards. That makes it third and three. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. He's scrambling, runs with it, and he's got room. And they make the stop around the 47-yard line. Second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Gains his way to the 30-yard line. Gets out to around the 18. So he keeps it, and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. He makes it to the 18-yard line. The Yellow Jackets call a timeout. That's their second of the half. Second down and 11 yards to the sticks. Ball on the 18. The 10 gets out to around the 6. Here's play number 10 on the drive. They give it to the fullback on the option. He gets back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. It's second and goal. Six yards to the end zone. Nice run up the middle. Around four yards there on the quarterback keeper. That makes it third and goal. This is the 12th play of this drive. Got to be careful of a pass play with this defense. Smart decision to keep it for the score. And he converts the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Taken from the three-yard line. And he makes it out to about the 27-yard line. The offense will come out again hoping to have similar results as their last drive. 
I love to watch a quarterback when he can really get into sync with his wide receiver. These guys have worked all week on their preparation to attack this defense, and right now, it's really paying off. They can't connect incomplete. It's an intelligent play by the defender. All you have to do sometimes is get your hand on the ball. From their own 27-yard line, it's second down. Tennessee is up by four. Going deep. And he's tackled right away. Tennessee is going to use their first time out of the half here. And they got him for a loss. Tennessee is going to have to use their second time out of the half. It's second down, 12 to go. Ball on the 36. In the shotgun and five wide out. Throws complete, and he's hit right away. That makes it 37. Got it, and brought down immediately. Johnson on the tackle at the 25 yard line. That makes it fourth and inches. It's up, looks long enough, and he splits the uprights. And he's got to be happy about that kick. Oh, no question. This kid is just a solid kicker. 27-20, Tennessee. Well, we played a half of football. The Volunteers with a touchdown lead. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. He's Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. Welcome to the tackling optional portion of our coverage. Offensive fireworks everywhere, but I saw you as a defensive guy over there sort of twitching. <laughs> where, where, where was the defense in this game? Yeah, the defense was optional, Reese, and they didn't really show up. And it's, it's, it's awesome when you have great offensive execution and you go up and down the field and you're throwing passes in tight windows, but it's another thing when guys are wide open. It's another thing when you can't tackle whatsoever. It's discouraging to watch, but if you wanted to see the scoreboard tick up and up and up and up, you're going to see more of that probably in the second half. Nothing's really going to change, and if you like fireworks, there's probably some more coming your way. Just about time to start the second half. What, what do you think Herb Street's first point of analysis will be? Uh, I don't know, something to do with quarterback play, I'm sure. I mean, we've got to hear that stuff all the time. It's all about the quarterbacks. Brad and Kirk ready for the second half. All right, Reese, David, thanks, guys. Just about set to start the third quarter. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He got hit hard. Both these offenses stepping up and answering the bell. Who's going to blink first here? <laughs> exactly right. I've just been impressed with the way they've been able to execute. I mean, there's, there's a lot of pressure on them. Anytime you're feeling that the other offense can put points up on the board, there's a tendency to want to press. There was one, neither one has done that up to this point, and right now it's going to come down to who can continue to execute put points up. The quarterback leads the offense back out onto the field as we get set to resume play. Tennessee is up seven. Nice run there. Chandler gets about four yards on the play. That makes it second and six. Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 26. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Stays in bounds and made a nice catch. That's good for a gain of eight yards. First down. run up the middle. Chandler gets seven yards on the play. That makes it second and two. So it's second down and about two yards to go. He's taken down at the 48. The ball carrier. Gain of 11 on the play. First down. And he just 
just gets rid of it. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. From the 48-yard line, second down. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Gain of four yards. Third down. Tennessee is up a score. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. and he's got room makes it out to about the 29 that brings up second short down. yardage situation here it's second down and one he makes his way to about the 38. Pitch and he's got some room. Makes it out to about the 50. From midfield, it's first down. And down he goes to 39 yard line. The Yellow Jackets had one of their key players go down earlier, but it looks like he might be able to get back in the lineup. On play action, he'll scramble, and he tackles him hard at the 35-yard line. Game of four on the play. That makes it second and six. Second and six. Ball on the 35-yard line. it out to about the 20. Call it a gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. And this play is number eight on the drive. 34 is the mic. 34 is the mic. He's got Check in. Check in. Let's go. They'll drop in for a loss. Loss of one yard on the play. That makes it third and three. They need about three yards to get the first down. Here on third down. The Yellow Jackets running back taken out earlier, sideline with that injury. However, it looks like he's going to be able to come back in this game. Decent run here, right side. This is the tenth play of this drive. Makes his way out to about the six. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. He's going to try and scramble. Bumble! And they fall on the loose ball, diving for extra yardage. That just shows you how determined this defense is. Great play by the linebacker to come up with the ball after the fumble. Their last drive ended in a punch, so this quarterback's going to be looking for something better on this drive. 
to come out of their goal line set. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That's good for a gain of five yards. That brings up second and five. They line up at the seven. Second down. Tennessee up seven points. There's a strike complete. And he's shoved out of bounds at the 13-yard line. Six yards. First down. He's tackled at the 26-yard line. That's good for a game of 13 yards. That First and 10, ball on the 26. He gets rid of this one. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. to the tailback, and he's met in the backfield. Third down and 12. Ball on their own 24. Here they come. Once and all, going deep. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Stewart, the return man. Stewart takes it to 36. Tackle at the 44-yard line. Misfortune struck as their last drive ended in a fumble. Each possession gets more and more vital as the game goes on, especially when you're behind. You can't afford to make many more mistakes. Tailback brought down for a loss. Loss of two yards in the That'll bring up second and 12. It's second and 12. Ball on their own 42. hit out of bounds at about the 37 yard line the offensive lineman played that one perfectly giving the tailback plenty of space to work with and he took advantage of it we've got a first and ten ball on the 37 After a decent run up the gut. Gain of five on the play. That brings up second and five. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. That's good for a gain of two yards. Third down. Third down, and they're gonna need about three yards to pick up the first down. run there as they work the outside. That's good for the game three yards. First down. Right, 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 right. And they'll bring him down behind the line. Yards on the play. That'll bring up second and 15. From the 31-yard line. Second down. Here's the pitch, and now he's got the corner. They'll bring him down right around the 18-yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. 
defense coming to the line. They'd like to force another red zone fumble and keep points off the scoreboard here. He did not get to the first down marker. It's fourth down. They'll line it up for the field goal. He gets it up, and they tack on three points. Georgia Tech ready to kick this one off. From his own goal line. He's tackled at the 26. Georgia Tech's playing much better on the defensive side of the ball here in the third quarter. Well, Brad, I think what I've seen is they were just doing too much in the first half. They've streamlined their attack, and I think it's made it a little bit easier for their players to understand what to do, and they're playing a lot faster. The offense is looking to be a little bit more successful with this drive as they had to punt the ball away the last time they had it. And they get nice yardage on that run. That's good for a gain of seven yards. That'll make it second and four. They're about four yards away here on second down. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlet. Gets it out to the wide out, and he's got the first. And they make the stop at the 47. That makes it first and ten. Tennessee is up four. He's on the run. It's a fumble. It's recovered. Tackle made around the 38-yard line. They're going to review this fumble, and I've got to tell you, I think he was down before the ball popped loose. I don't know about this one, Brad. They called it a fumble on the field, and they need indisputable video evidence to overturn this call. After review of the play, the ruling on the field is reversed. So after some discussion, the call on the field is reversed. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and long. Just throws this one away. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. Sack. Coaches don't like it when their quarterback gets hit like that. Don't be surprised to see the old coach get on his lineman to protect the quarterback a little bit better. Fourth and long here after the sack. Brooks is waiting for the snap. Stewart fields it at the 26, and down he goes at the 38. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure, but they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Tackle at the 49. First and 10, ball on the 49. Well, the third quarter is in the books, and you have to wonder if either defense is going to make a stop in the fourth. Tennessee's up by four. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. run up the middle. Benson picks up a good six yards there on the option play to the fullback. That'll make it second so it's second down now and they need about four yards to pick up the first. And he's tackled at the 35. And he 
he's taken down at about the 27 yard line well we've got a player down and let's hope that's that nothing serious short yardage situation here it's second down and one in and he's got a lane inside the 10 and it's a whole new ball game you love to have a home run threat like him in the backfield every time he touches the ball he's capable of tearing one off like that so the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point and he hits the PAT it was a five-play, 63-yard drive, and they put up seven points. And Brad, right now, the offensive line just winning the battle in the trenches, opening up some big runs. King, ready to kick. Taken from the three-yard line. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. Well, this is a competitive game. It's fun to watch these two teams go back and forth. Just when you think one team has the edge, the other gets right back into it. This is exciting. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. The defense has got some of their best pass defenders on the field. They set up in the dime to counter that five wide receiver set. He's taken down around the 47-yard line. First and ten. From their own 47 yard line. First down. 51 Mike. Mike 51. Here we go. Deep. All day. Ah! <laughs> Makes it out to about the 43. Call it a gain of 10 yards. That'll make it second and in inches. And they're going to put six DBs on the field to counter that five receiver look. He's hit and taken down. It's complete for about seven yards and a first down. Nice protection, a good pass, and even a better catch. You can't ask for much more than that. From the 36 yard line, first down. He's going right. Got it. Complete. He's out of bounds. This is why it's so important to have success in running the football. It forces a defense to prepare for it, and then that creates chances on play action. They executed that one perfectly. Right down at about the 29-yard line. That took a little too long to develop. And the offense was trying to get the pass rush going upfield, but the defense did a nice job of sniffing out the draw play and hitting them in the backfield. Second down, and they've got 15 for the first down. Ball on the 29-yard line. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. So it's fourth down. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. The kick is up, and it splits the uprights. Steve Maglia looks ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. This is when things get a little prickly. You need your playmakers to really come through here. Now he pitches it, and he has it on the corner. Out of bounds at about the 33-yard line. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks.
coming up third and inches. And now he pitches it. Taken down as he works the left for a nice game. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 39-yard line. Pitch out, got the corner. Runs it right, nice pickup. Six yards after taking it himself on the option. That'll make it second and four. Laterals back and he's got space. He's pushed out of bounds around the 35 yard line. From the 35 yard line. First down. He's at the 20. Inside the 10. And they finally bring him down at the five yard line. That makes it first and goal. We're at play number nine of this current drive. Silva halfback took it in for six. Simple play call there by the offensive coordinator. Just give it to the back and let him find his way into the end zone. And he tacks on the extra point. A nine-play, 76-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear you apart. It can really demoralize a defense when they drive the ball down the field, and a lot of the yards came on the ground. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 24. Let's see what they can do on offense as they take possession after the return. Well, they have a little bit of time, but I think it's very crucial that they get the ball in the end zone on this possession. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. He gets to about the 34-yard line. That makes it first and 10. From their own 34-yard line. First down. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Call it a gain of four yards. That makes it second and six. Mike 12. Mike 12. Man left, man left. Watch 19. Watch 19. And he tackles him hard at the 47 yard line. First down. It's first and ten. Ball on the 47. And the corner on the interception. Oh, no. They really didn't need that. And as a quarterback, you can't give up an interception late in the game. you got to be more careful with the football. Georgia Tech is up seven. Hey! 
Nice run to the left there. They're about four yards away here on second down. And now he's got room to run. And he shoved out of bounds at the 49-yard line. play the fullback got about six yards there that'll make it second and four so it's second down now and they need about four yards to pick up the first He's at the 30. They'll bring him down around the 22-yard line. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 22-yard line. He's going to use their first time out of the half here. It's second and 11. Ball on the 23-yard line. Just under two to go in the game. He's tackled right around the 22-yard line. The Volunteers call a timeout. That's their second of the half. And this play is number eight on the drive. up for the field goal. Kicks up, and it's through the uprights. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. He's to the 20. And he's tackled at the 28-yard line. Here's a step in the maturation of a young quarterback. How does he respond to throwing an interception on that last drive? This quarterback can make good passes. He just needs to focus on not forcing the ball to his receivers. Fires it quickly. And they finally knock him out at the 44-yard line. Complete. He gets to 100 yards receiving with that grab. Well, this guy is such a big part of this offense. If he doesn't get his numbers, they usually don't have much success moving the football. From the 44-yard line, it's first down. Fires to his receiver, first down. That's a game of 15 on the play. First down. Complete pass and hit hard as he came down with it. That'll make it second and seven. Just over a minute in the fourth quarter. And he stops the clock with a spike. Third down. Third down, and they need to get it to the 19. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Throws to the receiver, incomplete. Brad, I don't know about you, but it looked to me that they just miscommunicated. 
It looked like the wide receiver was going in one direction and the quarterback was throwing it another direction. They definitely need to get on the same page. It's up, looks long enough, and he splits the uprights. And he's taken down at the 40-yard line. Georgia Tech's a team on a mission right now, it appears. They have put up 20 points in a row. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. And they make the stop at about the 37-yard line. Just a minute remains in this football game. Tennessee's out of timeout. Runs it left for a decent game. set of downs, a chance to kill even more times. That's going to do it for this one. Our final score, Georgia Tech 40, Tennessee 33. And the Tennessee Volunteers 33. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.